Hi and welcome to Tykes TV. Today I've got Gaz on. Uh, you may have seen him um, on other video. So Gaz, great to have you back on again, mate. Tired it? Um, yeah, there's been a bit of a, a few press conferences with one with fans and then one with uh, mainstream media. Just about stuff, you know, the board reshuffle. We've got a bit better idea now on certain players and managers that uh, might be in forefront for Barnsley, head coach manager job. So what, what what's your take on it for of it last well said weekend really to be fair, Gaz? I think I'm I, I probably speak for I don't know, ninety percent of Arsley fans that um I think there's certain questions still needed to be answered. Hmm. Um I, I'm not saying it's cloak and dagger, I'm not saying it's old tells other but I think we're still thinking that do we know the full truth? Hmm. The old truth. I don't know. I, yeah. I don't know. I'm I'm still up in air, to be fair. I, I know. Uh, I I watched that a few times with Jean Crane. She got emotional, and it's understandable. Oh, very, very much we, so. we, and, we, I, I don't, and do you know what? I don't know whether that was um, a nice thing or a bad thing, but yeah. it was an honest thing, definitely. Yeah, and you could you could tell via and. It, you know, you, you could tell how much it means to you know Gene and Patrick, God rest his soul. But yeah. what they believe in the in the club is that what it means to us as as fans and the community, as a town and stuff like that. And you could tell, and I think you could also visibly see as well. Even Nadeev touched on it, and he touched on it on Friday oh. when I met up with uh, Brian as well from Barnes of Foreign Legion. Um, he got asked questions of our rumblings going off in the boardroom as well. So it's. For for Gene as well, knowing that what Patrick did, it's got to hurt even more so because of that yeah. connection there. And it, it 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 kind of upset me seeing her like that as well because it, it's like part I could relate to it kind of thing because it's our club in it. You know what I mean? Yeah. I think that Nadeem means well. Um, uh, they obviously like actions louder than words. Still, like I think part of me we wanted to move on and go, but. I know that Conway and Lee still got these shares in club. I know they've not got a set uh, a day to day control and interest in club. But ideally, for me, I'd love to see it and probably the rest of the Barnsley fans would as well to see them shares go. Whether it go to such as us as fans have an opportunity, uh, whether anybody on board wants to pick up them, um, them shares. I mean, again, that's if they you know, Bear wanted to sell Conway and Lee. But would you be because a, a few people mentioned it to me, and I thought, yeah, you know, I never get it a thought. But if say, a certain percentage of, of these shares were made available to club or supporters trust club, or don't like that, would you would you be up for that, guys? It's been muted before, hasn't it? Over the mm. last few, well, for the last what 20, 20 years, probably mm. twenty odd years. Uh, would it be a, a feasible option? Uh, I've got a couple of quid in bank. And if I'd got millions in bank, would mm. I like club? Yeah, I would. But would I want to be one percent older? Mm. Probably not. So mm. I don't know. Um, all I want is our club to be run and be looked after by people who care about the club, not about making money, just custodian. Patrick always used to say. It, it weren't. It were a custodian. Custodian. And I could see Jean's face over there. Yeah. And I just thought, you know what? Yeah. Art wrenching, actually. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So I, I'd leave it at that, really. And as long as we've got a, one or two people um, looking after our interests, then um, I, I'll 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 trust them. Yeah. I think. We Nadeev, I mean, it's it's coming over as these, you know, what I've what I've heard and what I've asked questions and that, he, and he's always said via targets on my back, and he's openly he's been via, and he could tell frustration, or I could tell frustration on Friday night when I was via, but certain things didn't agree with on board, but I felt that he thought it was like a minority with more than ten percentage of shares that he wanted to go a certain route, but you know the others were like so blink of vision they wanted to do that. Interesting to hear both uh, Khalid and uh, Nadeev as, as well yesterday saying about the, you know, the leadership and the experience of not not just the team but the squad. And I thought, yeah, the squad. 
because it's it's going to be a, a, yeah. a lot more rev, uh, prevalent in the League One because there's going to be more games. So for me, they're identifying this as well. You know, that this is what we need to try and get out at League because we, we don't want to be back in Championship. But again, we've got to go back to the manager situation and I, I, I won't expect it to be fair. Kali to be coming out and saying, you know, Duff and uh, Asselbank uh, to up with approach. I thought we were going to like say, well, there's ongoing talks. I, I was really surprised about. Were you, were you surprised about if we were going to name anybody? Um, well, I won't say a name as you. Hmm. Apart from uh, Barry, um, what we called? What did I put up over there? Barry. Um... Oh. I forgot now. I swore there, but. Um, yeah, but he snapped. Yeah, it. you put it up, didn't it? Yeah, yeah. I think, yeah, I think you might be with your choice. Um, but <laughs> no, uh, I don't know. I, I really, really don't know which way we should go. But it's the uh, hierarchy that that's going to decide. So we're going to go out same route. Like I think I spoke to you. Well, well last time I spoke to you. But it Barry, be... Barry Bladder, Barry, Bar- <laughs> Barry Bladder, oh, thanks, snapped him. <laughs> <That's> him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, mate, yeah, I've seen we've two more timers, and <laughs> but, uh, yeah, <laughs> I like Angel, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> A few interviews for that one, mate, <laughs> yeah. about 25, I think. But, uh... <laughs> but, uh... mm. I... I, I really, really don't know. Mm. I blow all the time, every single time, me on BBS. Uh, I'm cutting stunt by the way on BBS. And every single time, I just say, all the way, all the way, all the way, all the time. Because he's a sort of person I'd love to be manager mm. at our club. And I really would. Whether that's the right way to go, who knows? Mm. What's Ruber? What Ishmael? Yeah. I don't know. Mm. I really, really don't know. Uh, I just, I just really want it to be somebody who invigorates fan base. We've been on today. That have we sold six and a half thousand season tickets? About six and a half thousand, yeah. Yeah, which yeah. I, I, do you know what? I'm surprised about that. Mm. Uh, but. Um, if that's the case, then it's five thousand down on previous season. So hmm. we need some. We need. We, we need something to stimulate. Stimulate to put back. positive in it, positive back to the club again, isn't it? For fans yeah. to believe 100%, in it. Yeah, yeah, hundred percent. And uh, it got asked. Uh, that question got asked as well uh, about the season tickets. I know they kept it, uh, they kept extending the, the timeline, didn't they? The early bird season ticket. And again, it's I, I don't mind to look at it as well. If a manager had probably been announced before early bird, obviously there's things go up in background, but I'm, I don't know. Would it, would it have got a few more bums on seats kind of thing? And it's one of them if books and maybe's how come it's taking so long? We, we, we don't know. I mean. They're drawing up a list. They're, they're going through all these processes, uh, interviews and stuff like that. They might be struggling yeah. blocks with their agents and things. It could be, you know, it's not... I think because as fans, we all want to, a manager in place and we all want to know. But again, you don't know what's going on behind the scenes and stuff. But um, what they did a lot to is it's going to be next week or two, we're going to get, you know, an head, head coach, head manager, whatever you want to call them, in, in place. So I think... You need you need to be you need to have a manager in place. I I think before pre season starts. Yeah. Um, Devaney, I think he's going to be more or less in that first team situation anyway. So we're good via. It'd be interesting to see though whoever comes in if they're going to be wanting any of their backroom staff and all. Cause that could be a, another bit of a jig about, couldn't it? You know what I mean? Well, that Neil Turnip. Uh, Barry Bladder, wasn't it? Uh, oh, uh, Frank snapped in. Earth's fan rental and Dean Turnip. Uh, yeah. Dean Turnip, are uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, Some classics on there. We'll come on to that, actually, because uh, I up and down. I know through COVID and stuff like that, it, it, were, uh, it were bad and it affected your uh, gas. 
So, are we going to be seeing it in a paper format again? Yeah, first game of next season, home game. Okay. We we had an uh, issue, what, eight or nine? Uh, nine, I think. We had, um, we it was good to go hmm. just before fans got banned. Um, so, we are face to face sales. It doesn't even cover costs. Hmm. So it costs about between four and five hundred quid to co- uh, to to print. Hmm. Um, everything that time and effort, everything else goes into just loving club really. Uh, so we own back, and luckily, we in a couple of days that uh, we couldn't print it. Hmm. So and then there were that much things changing. Uh, so we, we are hung back, hung back, hung back. And then, uh, so yeah, we'll back for first game next season. Good. Yeah. So um, I, spend your two pounds all for charity. Yeah. And I just want to say that it's all for charity. And I just want to say that such as like yourselves, uh, Gaz, uh, Elp and Dan, it's kept us through bad times as well through COVID and even a uh, bad season like it has. We've had some laughs from it. Uh you know, and that's this is what it's all about. Having, having some laughs, laugh at your son, uh, don't take it serious or out like that. And a shout out to our other forums out there as well Tykes Blog, Imp Red Corner, Reds All Over, you know, Bounds on Tubers loads and of loads of there. There's loads of like, your uh, Red All Over, Red Sky, loads of people who do match, match day blogs, yeah. um, us, um, Redfin's Bar, Supporters Trust. It's just because people do it because they love the club. Yeah, they absolutely love it. They, they put time and effort in, uh, over and above, um, and just just because they love the club, and just because it's um, something that they maybe enjoy doing. But realistically, they, they absolutely do it for the love. I mean, you'll think on about a club like Barnsley, and, and and there'll be other clubs out there. But they won't have as much as a. A presence on like what we're doing, like on uh, on Twitter and on your reports and stuff like that, uh, fanzines and YouTube channels. But the clubs out there, not you know, might have had one or two, but for me, someone like Bounds, it's good promoting it, you know, uh, getting Bounds out there to all, all masses kind of thing. And like I said, at the end of the day, we've done it through bad times, all being well, next year is going to be through good times again, and uh, it's going to be even more stuff coming out. Yeah. Uh, so, like I said. For like like just said there, all all channels, all all the forums of people what do reporting and write up tax blog, bounds of polls and other and comes out with good content and stuff. It it, it goes if and if I miss your art or if guys miss your art, I do apologize, but there's that many art there. It's there just is, a, it's just a mention, isn't it? I, I was conscious about that to be fair. Hmm. Um that um I didn't want to miss anybody out because um no matter whether you do one thing a year or you're on it every week. It, 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 it's still important. It's still um, it, it, it's part and parcel of the journey that you 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 do it because you love it, not because mm. you're not getting paid for it. Mm. Like you are not getting paid for this. I'm not getting paid for that. But you you, you do you, just, you do it because you have an interest, or you or, or just because you love the club. Yeah, and that's what it's all about. It's loving club, and like I said, it you know you can see it in Jean. Uh, when when she were up there, kind of thing, and like what what we're doing, what you're doing. I mean, so, such as uh, your guys were doing printed copy and stuff. Like you said, but running costs, it's taking your time and doing stuff like that. The money goes to charity, but it's because you love the club, you know, and it's for mm-hmm. fans. It's to appreciate it and we, we, we the stuff, you know. It, and it's been hard when we've been commenting on some games and it's been poor games, but you still you still do it because you love it and. You know, I'm, like I said, I'm hoping there's going to be a, a lot more positives. I know there's been uh, pre-season uh, some fixtures announced. I think we've got Workshop Crew and Chef United. But oh, on, that ju- uh, and on July 16th, I think there's an open day, but was also a game in afternoon. I think or something like that to be confirmed. So it's like the club again is wanting to go out for fans. You know, and and you know what? I love that. I absolutely love it. Mm. You know, like these um, over the last few days, they've done them. Um, um, stadium tours and stuff mm. like that, mm. brilliant. And I hope that continues. I really do because, yes. uh, like, like I mentioned a few minutes ago, 
that uh, we do what we do because we love our club. Yeah. And I hope the club realise that people like us that do it and I hope it continues. I, do. I hope it continues and I hope it continues for longer as well because, yeah. um, I mean, if, if you go on like now from saying to us, we've sold out, we've gone. So uh-huh. just because to prove out, we've had a bad season. Could you imagine if we've had like a, a fantastic season? We'd have, been, we'd have gone we in days. And we've had a poor season, but people still wanted to go. And that, that says that we, we want we want Barnsley, you know. So I'm hoping that if there's anybody from the club watching, fair play to you, you're reaching out and that. But I think that probably, if you could have probably put another two or three events on like that for, for staying to us, we'd probably sell out again. <laughs> you know what I mean? But it's that popular. Be that popular. It, it does. It feels like we need a reconnection. Yeah, absolutely, hundred percent reconnection. That um, <laughs> I said it last time we're on with you. Mm. I think a lot of people have fallen out of love a little bit, mm. and we, we need something—a connection, uh, a, a reconnection—that to want to get a bit of passion back. Mm. So I hope it continues. And fair play to the media team and to uh, commercial people and stuff like that. Carry on doing what you're doing because we need you as much as we need them. And I think that's a good thing to uh, to end it on that, guys, what you've just said there. Fair play to all, all, all people involved at Barnsley, the, like reconnection, what you've just said there to media team, to commercial team, to everybody that we're branching out. And it's like what you said, is we need you, you need, you know, it works both ways. And I think yeah, now it's coming through. We, we have it, well, in the last couple of days, we've had a couple of press conferences, one for fans on Friday, then the media, and they stayed him to us. You know, early bird season being extended and extended as much as we possibly can. So, so, just seeing Jean Crean, uh, Jean crying, sorry, how much it means to her crying. Yeah. When you see Khalid, he understands. I think Nareev is bought into the fact that he wants to go to that way with Barnsley, and he under, he understands. I think he's bought into what it means to Jean, and it's like affecting him kind of thing. So all yeah. I can see at the minute is positives. Yeah, there'll be people saying, but they've got a percent control, you know, percent uh, percentage of shares in there. They have, but we haven't got a day-to-day running it. And I'm hoping that if we can carry on doing what we're doing, someone can come in and tie, tie them shares up and say, do you go, gone. And then we can move on as a collective. Uh, but I think it's a great point that what you've uh, raised on that one, Gaz, is that as much as we need the club, the club needs us as well. And it's it's in his blood, and it? It's in his DNA. Yeah. Before we go, yeah. everybody else I mentioned earlier, you're read all over bloggers, everybody, anybody who puts their time and effort into um, contributing to, I hate doing that, but the fan experience, Hmm. fair play to you, carry on doing it, because you do it because we love it, so carry on, and it's appreciated. Appreciate you as well, uh, Gas, for taking your time out as well, joining me, mate. Uh, really do appreciate it. It's always a good laugh for you. I love it. Uh, and I just want to echo what Gas says. Everybody read all over uh, in the corner, bounds on to uh, tights, blogs, there's bounds for foreign legion, there's absolute loads and loads, match day drinkers and everybody out there. Uh, it's been a nice season. More obvious if you're watching. <laughs> <laughs> it's been loads and loads it's been a bad season all being well we've turned corner we can see a bit of light end it tunnel let's build on it keep momentum going uh, Gaz Absolutely. once again thanks for joining me mate I do appreciate it everybody out there please comment like subscribe and share uh, when it does come out as well please buy A Up and Down it's all for charity and they do some really good content really it's good shit content like books, buy it <laughs> <laughs> Can't get more honest review than that, can you? So, thanks for watching. Uh, one thing left to say: you Reds. Oh, birds.